Uh, first, tell us what is the mood in your team? How overwhelmed are you? How proud and how happy are you today? No, they are very joyful. They are excited to see the success of their hard work uh, happening uh, right on moon. And uh, all that they wanted to achieve, the nominal mission has been achieved. So they are really excited uh, to see further work uh, to happen now, uh, including the science experiment that had to happen. It also involves complex processes, complex activities, and involves a lot of systems on board to work very well. So they're all looking for towards that now. Uh, take us through the last 15 minutes. Like uh, I saw the live visuals. All of you were quite relaxed. You knew what was happening. Things were under control. Take us through what, what you were going through in the last 15 minutes since the start of the power descent till the touchdown. See, when uh, such an event takes place, the, especially like a landing, it is uh, like a rocket launch. You know, rocket launch also hundreds and thousands of events takes place, measurements and complex functionality do happen. So it is similar to that. So we were all uh, waiting, with, uh, waiting for the things to happen as nominally planned, but excited, yes. Uh, we have, it's been almost 12 hours since we have done a soft landing. Yeah. When India slept, the rover was just coming out. When India woke up this morning, we had to see the tweet that India has taken the first steps on the moon. Tell us the next course of action. What is the Pragya and rover doing right now? How far would it go? What experiments would it carry on? See, Pragya and rover is just on the moon now. Now we have to move it further. There are a lot of things to do, which includes path planning, traveling little more distances. Then after that, uh, doing experiments with it. But that will take some more time. And uh, we have to have various other conditions uh, suitable for it, including ground visibility, the ground stations availability, and very, many things have to be checked. So depending on that, uh, further activities on rover will take place. The data is quite crucial, is what everyone is saying. We have seen scientists from US, Europe, across the globe congratulating you and saying this is not just an achievement for India, for the humanity as well, because southern part of the moon, south pole of the moon, no one has gone. And there are evidences that there might be water right. hidden there. Yeah, as uh, told by Honorable Prime Minister yesterday, he was also specifically telling it, this mission is just not for India alone. It's for the whole world so that the other people get inspired to travel to moon and then find out ex uh, and explore. I think there is a renewed interest in going to the southern part of the moon, uh, hopefully to look for more of uh, resources, natural resources that is suitable for human beings for its colonization or further, e further expansion or, uh, or traveling beyond moon. So uh, scientific community across the globe are very keen to see that we succeed and also bring out uh, useful scientific results as we did for Chandrayaan 192.